Ah, uh, fiddle's a fiddle I am. Yeah, nah. Never need to go to the doctor. Unlike you. <laughs> Always hold up the toilet. <laughs> nah, she'll be right. Just gotta toughen up. It'll sort itself out. Men are found to be more likely to suffer from serious health problems than women. This is likely because compared to women, men visit the doctor less frequently, have shorter visits, and often only attend when it's too late. Before we explain what all the fuss is about, let's first get this straight. Nearly 70% of us find it easier to care for our cars than we do our own health by ignoring problems that are potentially treatable. Unlike our cars, more than half of us would avoid getting things checked even after noticing a problem for more than six months. Unsurprisingly, almost half of us have also admitted that we're not always honest about our health because we're not ready to deal with the problems we might face if we're told the truth. All of this is putting us men at risk, but what's behind it and how can we do better? For a start, let's address some of the reasons why we put things off. Step one, find a doctor you trust. But you'll never know unless you try. Check the local listings for doctors in your area Call around and ask questions. It's also a good idea to check online or with friends and family for recommended doctors. 2. I can't afford it or I don't want to spend the money. Getting a health checkup shouldn't cost you an arm and a leg, unless you've actually left it too late. Ask around for a reasonably priced health check. Besides, it makes more sense to spend a little and save a lot, rather than to save a little and spend a lot. If you think spending time with a doctor is expensive, imagine spending time in a hospital. 3. I don't have time and there's probably nothing wrong. There are 8,760 hours a year and you want to save 2? And yes, there's probably nothing wrong, but you're not a doctor. That's why you need one. Many serious but treatable conditions don't have symptoms. Putting two hours aside to see a doctor can make a huge difference. Finding a problem early could save your life. 4. Doctors don't do anything for what I pay for. When you see your mechanic for a checkup, your car gets serviced. So when you get your health checked, the doctor gives you tests and advice. Just like the car, it might not seem like you get much from it, but you do. 5. I hate needles. I don't want to get probed. I'd rather tough it out. You don't need to get jabbed or have a prostate exam unless you actually need them. And even then, remember that it's much better to catch things early and treat them. You will get a choice and these things are only a small part of a medical. Don't let one thing scare you from the benefits of all the other things you can have. 6. I don't want to hear what I might be told, and I don't like being told what to do. Maybe we smoke, drink a fair bit, or have put on weight. So what? Our doctor's there to help. Sometimes we just need that little bit of medical coaching to help us quit or help turn our lives around. Maybe our significant other has been nagging us about it. Perhaps it's time to take the step. Chances are you already know all this. But what's at stake is far more important than that. You probably think that you can pay to get most things fixed, but when it comes to your health, the longer we leave it, the harder it gets. And just like your ride's yearly service, perhaps it's time to book yourself in for a quick checkup before that nagging complaint turns into something bigger. Speak to your doctor about your health in general, if you should have some tests done, or if the medication you have been taking is right for you.